Shalom, this is Bishop Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ. I have an important message about your leaders in the Christian church. Your bishops, pastors, reverends, and ministers are all lying to you and leading you straight to damnation. The truth is, you so-called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans are the biblical Israelites, according to Deuteronomy chapter 28. Jesus Christ is a black man with white wool hair, according to Revelation chapter 1, verses 14 and 15. We as the Israelites must keep the commandments in the faith of Christ to receive salvation, as it is written in Revelation chapter 14, verse 12. I've challenged and debated Christian authorities all over the world on these issues. Not one of them has been able to negate this truth. Your pastors have led you astray, worshiping pagan holidays and false gods, just as in the days of old. So join us on our mission to restore the true nation of Israel before the decree goes forth. The work is plentiful, but the laborers are few. Visit our website at israelunite.org or call us at 855-484-4842 to learn more and visit our schools. Shalom. Seize 
for Isaiah. Right. They made the image of a black man and took it and made it to the image of a white man. This is what they did in history. Give me Revel give me give me Revelation 13. You know what I want? Watch this. Let's see if the white man will keep this in his book. Let's see who is going to go into captivity. Read. Revelation chapter 13 and verse 10. No. Verse 9. Read. If any man have an ear, let him hear. So if you have an ear, hear what the Bible is about to say. Read. He that leadeth into captivity. Who led us into captivity? Who led us into captivity? Who put us in slave ships? Who did it? Who? 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 Who did it? Who put us in slave ships? Who did Who? this to us? Sumerians. Who did this to us? Sumerians. White men. Sumerians. White men. Sumerians. 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 Watch this. No, it's not, no. that's not their name. The Esau. The Esau's the Esau their name. The Arabs. The Arabs put us in captivity too. Yes, no, you're right. First. No, they did do no, it first. They, they did do it first. You're right. Do you know where that's at? That's in the Bible too. No. I'm going to read it to you. I'm going to read it to you. No, it doesn't. Watch. Repeat that leader into captivity. Shall go into captivity. So those who led us into captivity are going to do what? Go into captivity. We're going to go into captivity. That's right. The right. same way they led us in there is the same way they're going to go. Right. With chains. Right. Shackled to their necks and to their feet. Right. right. Read. Read he that killeth with the sword. He that killeth with the sword. When they shoot us down in these streets, when they drag us by, when they drag us by trucks, when they forcibly took us out from the left, from the west coast of Africa, bring it out. It's the same way that they're going to go into captivity. Bring right. it Read. He that killeth with the sword uh -huh. must be killed with the sword. They're going to die the same way they killed us. Bring it now out. let's go get prophets in Isaiah 14. Let's see if this is a white man's book. Why would the white man write in his book their destruction, right. their demise, right. that they're going to go into captivity with chains, that they're going to be hand, handmaids and servants? Read. Bring it out. Isaiah chapter 14. Read verse 1. Verse 1. Read. For the Lord will have mercy on Jacob. We are the children of Jacob. That's right. The so-called black man, Hispanic man, Native American yeah. man. Read. And will yet choose Israel. We're going to choose the nation of Israel. Read. And set them in their own land. We're going to go back to our land in Jerusalem. Read. And the strangers shall be torn and with them. And who? And the strangers shall be torn with them. And all nations are going to be joined with us. But how are they going to be joined with us? Are they going to be walking hand in hand? Read. And they shall cleave to the house of Jacob. Uh -huh. And the people shall take them and bring them to their places. Read. And the house of Israel shall possess them. We're going to do what with these people? Possess them. Every nation that had us in captivity are going to be beset, be possessed by the Israelites. That's right. Read. Possess them in the land of the Lord. For what? For servants. For what? For servants. For servants. The same way we serve them when they ruled. They're going to be servicing to us when we rule. Three. Right. Right. And handmaids. And what? And handmaids. Three. And they shall take them captive. You want to do what with them? Take them captive. They're going to be held captive the same way that we were held captive by them. Three. You know? Whose captives they were. Uh -huh. And they shall rule. And we're going to do what? They shall rule. And we're going to rule how? Over their oppressors. We're going to rule over our oppressors. That's right. Those ones who are opening up liquor stores on the corner, who, 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 who is allowing mass incarceration, they got the key boys out here, these young kids, these little young kids, they're, they're allowing the demonic music to be put on these streets that our kids are hearing today to continue to keep us oppressed. They're going to be, our, they're going to, we're going to own them. Right. We're going to possess them. Right. Right. We're going to have them captive the same way they had us captive. Right. You know what that is? That's righteous judgment for God. That is right. Read. Yes. is men leading by example. Oh, no, no, no.